hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl alicia s in the building if you're new here you're more than welcome if you're returning if you're a returning subscriber hi besties hi sandersam welcome back yet to another video i'm having like an updated q and a so i think in november i put like a ask me something on my instagram and then you guys did come through i got like more than 16 questions but then they were like repetitive so i just had to like note them down on my papai bucky and then i got myself hot noodles i just wanted to try like their noodles here and see like how hot it is so i already made them like can you guys see yeah like they are black not black but yeah i already made them and i hope they're still warm and then i also bought this new red blue i wanted to try it because i love the white one yeah so i wanted to try this one this is the um, apple flavor the apple flavor and then i also have water just in case and i have my 16 questions so without any further ado let's get right into this video so oh my goodness the very first question is how do you deal with stress how I deal with stress is, I don't really stress, but if I stress, I mostly cry. I'm someone who will cry like the hell out of myself. And then after crying, I'll sleep. That helps me a lot. It helps me not to think about it. But obviously, I try to talk to like someone who like understands me or something, you know? Yeah. So I try to talk to someone who understands me yeah i think that will help i guess that's how i deal with my stress and then the second question is when are you coming back i'm coming back next year i'll be back next year don't worry and the next question is what is your shoe size i don't know why you guys are so interested in my shoe size ah you don't buy me clothes or what i come my clothes shoes anyways i'm a size four techies and sandals and the fourth question is which airline did you use when you went to germany i used the uh, qatar airlines but we used the um, Rennie's traveling agencies yeah i used Rennie's traveling agencies and then Rennie's traveling agencies helped me um get the qatar airline i guess and they have good service so you should definitely go for them do you love it in germany yes i do it's okay it's a nice place it's okay it's a nice place i love it here it just gets lonely so yeah can you please explain how you got this opportunity oh my goodness this will take so long and i don't want to make this video long and most of these questions are only based on germany so i don't even know if i should like title it like a updated q a because you guys are just asking me about germany okay but i got this through my school you know i study social work there and then they like advertise this opportunity hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They advertised this opportunity and I was like, why not? That's how I got it. So we had to apply. We had to write a motivational letter. You had to have like a CV. Obviously, you have to have a motivational letter to tell them why they have to choose you. So I was like, let me go for it. I was scared because... The requirements where you have to be vaccinated, you had to have a passport, obviously, and yeah, that's it, a visa, yeah. So, before handing in your application, you had to go get vaccinated. So, I had to get vaccinated also, and then I had to ask my mom first, because obviously, I just can't apply like that, and then she was a bit against it at first. 
and then later on she's like you know what it's an opportunity and stuff like that so go for it so i went for vaccination i got the pfizer <coughs> pfizer vaccination i got both i'm fully vaccinated and i also got the booster yeah so i got three shots and then yeah then i applied i wrote the motivational letter and then i sorry i gave it in to a few people to read it before i send it in then i send it in and then i was shortlisted for interviews uh, i was super nervous but then yeah and i even gave up because the questions they were asking in that interview were so tough and i was like it's fine i'm not gonna make it and then like a week later i just see like an email from dr anania she's like congratulations i was so over the moon i swear <gasps> and then yeah that's what happened Mm. how old are you and are you the only child i am 20 i'm turning 21 next year no i'm the first born. i'm not the only child i have three siblings of our girls and then it, it says here how many languages do you speak how is germany okay i think i already answered how is germany I speak English, Afrikaans, Koi Kovab, Oshiero, Surya. What else? Yeah, a bit of Silozi, just a bit. And I also, I'm also learning Germany. So come on, Germany. I'm also learning German. So yeah, six, seven, yeah. What are you studying in Germany? Oh, I'm studying social work. I'm still studying social work. Like, yeah, I didn't change courses. Um, how did you manage to get the visa? It's hard for me. <clears throat> I won't lie. We had a very, very... They are not that chilly, though. We had a very, very tough time. Getting the visa. Because... Most people are very strict, but I just applied like on the net. <coughs> I applied on the net. Bad combination. How can I be drinking an energy drink like a cold drink? But yeah, it's actually good. It's not bad, but the white one is still hurt. So yeah, I I applied on the internet for an interview at the embassy, at the German embassy. It's there by Verno. At is it Verno? Yeah, it's Verno. There at Independence Avenue, next to the park, opposite the park. Yeah. Then I just applied. They sent me a letter, and then you had to for you for your interview to be a success, uh, a success, and for you to like yeah just get fast response or something just make sure you have like all your documents and then make sure you have like the fee because like for me we didn't pay for the sorry we didn't pay for the visa because our university here in germany paid for it so yeah i just got like my documents passport photo and everything yeah and your motivation just everything your health insurance those things like they are so 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 much into such stuff here so yeah you can dm me if it's not clear are you self-funded or not no i'm not self-funded i'm on an erasmus scholarship it pays for accommodation food health insurance and yeah that's basically it if you want to know more you can always drop a comment in the comment section to find out more about the erasmus program because it doesn't only fund like social work students it funds like everyone so anyone can like apply for the erasmus program and then yeah probably can get chosen as well and then i'm sorry to ask so much questions but are you gonna graduate in germany no i'm not gonna graduate here i'm gonna graduate in namibia at unum are you still single and why? To do, I am single. 
so single why i don't know maybe i'm not just ready for a relationship or i don't know why i'm single i'm just single there's no guys are you related to jacinta no the joke no but we're not related but we are like she's my sister she's my small sister she's like a family to me do you miss your family i miss my mom a lot my siblings cousins everyone i miss everyone i'm so sad because i won't be in katima this december yeah and then the last question how is student life in germany student life in germany is it's not that chilly guys i swear but i'm having a headache now it is chilly student life in germany is it's okay it's not bad a bit expensive yeah i mean life is just expensive now i understand like why my friends would like complain because you buy your own food you are basic you're basically expected to like discipline yourself you buy your own food toiletries everything is on you and then you still want to go out so it's basically you have to be disciplined so that's how i manage here but other than that everything else is fine but i just can't wait to go home anyways we've come to the end of the video if you did enjoy this video please drop this emoji down below guys i know my sit down videos don't get so much views but please watch it and if you have made it till this far please be proud of yourself because yeah sit down i won't lie myself i also don't enjoy sit down videos but yeah sometimes it is informative so yeah See you guys on my next vlogmas. Bye.